The countdown to Thanksgiving. AAA says a whopping 43.6 million Americans will travel 50 miles or more this week. The vast majority, 90%, will be driving this year. And this year, from weather to gridlock to gas, American families are in for quite a trip. Here's ABC's Alex Perez. Rena Wengard is a Thanksgiving week travel pro. She and the kids are making the two hour drive to see loved ones in Indiana today to avoid the mayhem of motorists later this week. It can get crazy. It's just you try and get off on the uh, rest areas. It's just people everywhere. The Wengards join some 39 million others who will be clogging roadways this Thanksgiving holiday. And as the stress on the roads begins, some relief at the pump. Gas prices down five cents in the last two weeks. But Thanksgiving carves out a week of worries on roadways. And with all of these families getting in their cars, the number of incidents will skyrocket this week. So here are a few things you should look out for. Like traveling on unfamiliar roadways, not knowing the lay of the land could be disastrous. Plan your route ahead of time so that you're not fumbling with the GPS or the directions or figuring out where you're trying to go and leave the navigation if possible to a passenger. Be mindful of the clock, 5 to 7 p.m. This week, rush hour becomes high risk hour. There are 20% more fatal crashes during those hours on Thanksgiving week than other weeks. Also, keep your eyes peeled for more deer in the headlights. November is the middle of the fall mating season when the animals tend to roam. Experts say the best way to maneuver the roads this week is just like fixing a Thanksgiving feast slowly and with lots of prep work. Alex Perez, ABC News, Chicago.